was promised to marry a man named Joseph, who lived there too. And one day, an angel from God came to talk to Mary. Mary, you're going to have a baby, and he will be the son of God. Okay. <laughs> and then the angel left. Now Joseph wasn't sure what to do when he heard that Mary was going to have a baby. So, one night while he was asleep, the angel came to talk to Joseph too. Joseph, Mary is going to have a baby from God. It is okay for you to marry her. You will name the baby Jesus. And so that's just what he did. A while later, the emperor in Rome, Caesar Augustus, said that everyone had to go to their own hometowns to be counted. Everyone go to your hometown so that I might count you. So Mary and Joseph went to the town of Bethlehem to be counted because Joseph was from the house and lineage of David. And Bethlehem was known as the city of David. There were lots of people there too. There were so many people there. In fact, there was no room for them to be in. So Mary and Joseph stayed in the stable, which was a place where animals stayed warm and dry. There was a cow there. <laughs> Eat more chicken. There was a sheep there. There was a chicken there. And even a horse. <laughs> While they were there, baby Jesus was born. <laughs> and Mary took him and wrapped him up in warm clothes and laid him in a manger. <laughs> He just that him. night, there were some shepherds out in the field watching over their flocks of sheep. And the angel came and talked to the shepherds, and they were terribly afraid. Don't be afraid, for I bring you good news. The Savior has been born in Bethlehem. You will find him wrapped in swaddling clothes, lying in a manger. And all of a sudden, there were lots of angels saying, Glory to God in the highest, peace on earth, and goodwill towards men. And then the angels left. And when the angels had left, the shepherds went and found the baby in the manger, just as it had been told. And when they found him, they worshipped him. Not far away, in a place called Jerusalem, there lived an evil king named Herod. One day, after baby Jesus had been born, wise men came to Jerusalem looking for the newly born king of the Jews. They asked King Herod where he was. So the king asked his advisors, So the wise men went and found baby Jesus by following his star, and so when they found him, they worshipped him. Yeah. Jesus, he wanted to harm him. The wise men were warned by God about this, so they went home another way. When the king found out he was tricked, he was really mad. Oh man, I'm really mad! <laughs> he was so determined to destroy this newly born king, King Herod sent out his soldiers in Bethlehem to Bethlehem to find baby Jesus. Go get him, boys! Yay! Get out of there. Get out of there! <laughs> and so they did. Mary and Joseph and the baby came back from Egypt and they went to live in the town of Nazareth again. And that's where baby Jesus grew up until he was grown. And so now you've heard it all about how God sent his one and only son to be born as a baby so later he could save everyone from their sins and all it took was just a little Christmas.
Bro! 